Welcome to Your Moment with Miguel Ramirez. Hello and welcome to Your Moment. My name is Miguel Ramirez and on today's show, I'm going to be welcoming back Carolyn Inman to discuss the mind game player. She delves into the characteristics and the types of personality traits a mind game player has and how a mind game player goes about searching for someone that's willing to accept his or her own behavior. Welcoming back, Carolyn Inman. Touching on the mind game player, this is something that I have seen others experience. In terms of the mind game player gaining satisfaction from what he wishes his partner to do, what makes a mind game player do what he does? Okay, let me give you an example. A person close to me was in a relationship. The boyfriend told her, your hair looks pretty straight, but it would look really so much prettier if it had curls. She didn't really like curls, but, you know, I'll please him. What the heck? Maybe it'll be fun. You know, so she makes curls and does that. And then he's, there's always verbal abuse in it, too. Well, you know, that looks good on most people, but not really. It doesn't look so good on you. I think you should go back to being straight. So she she actually did that. Okay, a little bit of time passes, and he comes back one night, and he says, there's this woman at work. She is adorable. She is so cute. She has this little pixie haircut. I think you should cut your hair. Now, at that point, this person had been talking to me, and I hadn't done the book or anything, but I just read other things. And I said, you know, this isn't about the hair. And so we talked through what it was about, what he was trying to do, and she didn't change her hair. She changed her boyfriend. Mm. So, you know, it was early in the relationship. It wasn't that hard to do. Mm -hmm. She just sent him on his way and looked for a guy that accepted her as she wanted. I think what's happening with the mind game player, it's a test. You know, we used to have a kind of a silly phrase, if I say jump, you'll say how How high. high, And then that's kind of what he's doing. And it's a game to him. That's why we call it game player. But it's also a test to see if I take away the money, will you be okay with that? In other words, one of the early ploys that he does. In terms of his own amusement, satisfaction, Mm -hmm. his own gain from what he's witnessing, that can lead to very serious, life-threatening situations from someone who complies and changes their hair and changes whatnot. And if it gets to adding alcohol, adding substances, I find of the seven characters, one of them are Mm -hmm. dangerous ones to look out for. It is dangerous because they start out tipping your foot in the water. You know, they'll start out with a little verbal abuse and see what you do. They'll start out with texting more and more and more. And if the person accepts it, they escalate. They do it more, they do it more. And as we were mentioning before, there isn't usually a person that only does one of these things. I don't know if there's people that do all seven of them, but they do more than one. And sometimes one is on the pathway to another. There's something I think it's really important, too. Everybody that is doing these things is not a candidate for a person that will hit you later. However, if you look at people who are in physical, they have done these things leading up to it. The reason we wrote this book instead of a traditional domestic violence book was that if a person can see this and isn't so taken by the love and the interest in the the other person, that they can make the choice to find someone who's better. I'd like to thank Carolyn Inman for dropping by. To follow me on social media, I'm at MMRS200 on Twitter, Snapchat, YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn. Be sure to follow me. And if you'd like to send in a message, let me know your thoughts or questions on any topic we cover. I always read the questions and I'd like to thank you for listening and have a good day. Stay up to date with news, interviews, and upcoming show episodes by following your moment with Miguel Ramirez on Spreaker.com. New episodes release every Friday at 6 p.m.